Oh, that's a tough question to be honest because I I, uh, I moved around the country a lot. I, I lived in Dunedin, lived in Porirua, lived in Fakatania, lived in Hawke's Bay. Uh, so uh, maybe the more the two notable schools, not well, notable, but the two schools I went to that um, at least I spent a lot of time at uh, were Tiote College and Trident High School. Uh, home is Nelson at the moment. Uh, well, not at the moment. Home is uh, definitely Nelson. I moved to uh, Nelson to play for Tasman. Um, fell in love with the place, uh, bought a house there recently, bought a home there recently, and, uh, and I look forward to getting back as much as possible. It's quiet, uh, it's sunny, uh, it's, got, it's got the um, coast there, but one of my favourite things is it's sort of on the doorstep to the um, national parks as well. That's one of my favourite things, is I want to sort of uh, try and do um, the great walks of New Zealand, and I know we've got one right on the doorstep, so those are one of the things that I want to do um, before, um, you know, sort of before I get to the top point where I can't walk, I'd like to do all of those walks and connect with my own country. I, I try to mix it up a little bit, I try to read a few books and try uh, play guitar, I can't play very well but that's why I'm sort of trying to learn how to play it. Uh, I try to do a couple of walks if, if I can and then um, I still sort of try to get involved in the volunteer rugby side of things, ref refereeing and coaching, uh, which is what I've been doing since I was 16 anyway, so um, sort of just going back to my roots and you know, all that sort of stuff and that sort of helped me get to where I am, um, all that knowledge that I learned along the way. I think I've, it's probably been about 12 years of refereeing. Uh, two years I wasn't registered, I was just um, doing it at school as part of a You Make the Call referee course. Um, and so that, that was pretty cool. It's, um, I put the certificate up on my wall. Uh, I sort of think to myself, I wonder if I'll get to 20. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's been a great uh, 10 years giving back to the community in, in terms of refereeing, uh, giving back to the sport. Um, so hopefully I can keep continuing that. Cool thing about being a front rower, I feel, is that you possibly I don't call it cheating because that's just part of our front row lifestyle as we indulge a little bit more in, uh, in uh, foods that you know help us keep our weight on to do our jobs. Um, uh, geez, like, I really seriously, I, there's so many foods that I, that I eat. I try to be disciplined, um, but one of my go-tos used to be cronuts. I just can't find them anywhere in Hamilton. Uh, 660. Uh, Cora, a bit of New Zealand stuff, uh, and sometimes uh, like sort of stuff you can sing along to, like Adele and all that sort of jazz. Um, you know, like when I'm in the gym and stuff, I don't actually um, either I don't listen to music or I listen to music that I, music that I can sing to. Um, not sing very well, but that I can sing to. So I'm not really into pump up music. Uh, I don't own a TV. I don't like watching TV. Um, I try to uh, listen to podcasts. Tim Ferriss. Um, or read books. I try to stay away from TV because it's been a bit of a time uh, uh, spender in the past at the moment. Now my Snapchat's taken up that, so now I've got to try and give that up. I sort of fell in love with Ireland, believe it or not. I know that probably doesn't sit like, people think to yourself, like, that's not a holiday destination, but I remember I sort of fell in love with um, Ireland and maybe Paris as well. I didn't think I would like Paris because I'm not a big city sort of person. I don't, I don't quite like busy cities. Um, but the amount of history that I saw there on my last trip there, oh, my first, you know, my first trip there, um, it was awesome. So, you know, maybe I could see myself going to those types of places. I'm not much of a, uh, I know I live in Nelson, I love the coast, but everyone in New Zealand does because we live so close to it. But so I've seen enough coast, I want to see some history. Unfortunately, I'm not a, a huge poster of um, content. I do hope to keep um, uh, sort of growing that. I actually want to start a blog that be, uh, I haven't started it yet, so I've got nothing to give you. Um, but you can find me on Instagram, Kane Hames, just K-A-N-E, H-A-M-E-S.